so hello everyone and welcome to my channel so as you know this is the first video of my channel and the first tutorial series of my channel uh, so in this tutorial series i'm going to teach you how to install uh, install unreal engine 4 and all the basic tools that you need to become a game developer using this engine so what is unreal engine 4 the most uh, most probably the most advanced a game engine that ever made it so before you get install unreal engine 4 you need to install epic games launcher to install this launcher you must go to your uh, browser then search for epic games launcher then you can see this uh, www.epicgames.com or or uh, you can uh, search for this in uh, your browser or use the link in description to uh, enter this website so I'm just going to click on this then next click on this uh, download epic games launcher here like this then it's gonna download the launcher for you not the launcher uh, the installer that you need to uh, that the installer that you can install this uh, epic games launcher so I'm not gonna download it again because I have downloaded it uh, right uh, here so I'm not gonna download it I'm just gonna cancel it but uh, you must download it then just minimize this tab then uh, double click on this it will open uh, a dialog box like this so just click on run it will show a dialog like this uh, box like this preparing to install so then it will uh, show this kind of a uh, uh, dialog box so here you have to click install if you are a, a new user if you already have this installed just click cancel then yes finish so once you installed it uh, you can see this epic games launcher uh, here so just do uh, double click on it then it will open up the uh, launcher for you so now my epic games launcher opens uh, uh, but if you are a new user you will show a different uh, interface uh, than my one so my one is a bit different uh, than uh, new users because I have uh, downloaded it before about uh, about uh, two years ago so I have all I already have an account uh, so the first users must show uh, should have get uh, uh, something just like this so choose how to sign into your epic account so if you already have an epic account or that you have signed in uh, with facebook google or xbox so that's for the uh, users that already have an account uh, but if you don't have an epic games account so just click on sign up so it will open something just like this so choose how would you like to sign up uh, to sign up uh, that means do, uh, if you have facebook account you can uh, sign in with a uh, sign up with their facebook uh, if you have google account uh, probably all most of the these people have a google account or else you can uh, use other kind of one so i'm just i'm just gonna uh, use this sign up with google so it will open up something just like this uh, but in the launcher it would be dif a bit different uh, it will automatically open your browser then it will show uh, something just like the, this uh, oops something wrong. yeah I have only one account link for this uh, browser because uh, uh, if you have a couple of uh, accounts link for this uh, your uh, web browser it will show us uh, some uh, dialog box like choose account uh, choose an account to continue with epic games uh, dot com then you have to fill this your country your first name uh, last name display name email address then you have to uh, uh, tick this then you have to click continue so it will create an uh, epic games account for you uh, once that uh, you uh, Law, create your account uh, it will open up this uh, epic games launcher automatically for you don't have to sign in with uh, sign in into it uh, again so at the startup screen uh, at the latest version of this engine you 
can uh, not the engine the uh, epic games launcher you can see something just like this uh, featured content that means uh, some or uh, this uh, shows their latest news and some new uh, important things and new releases and you can see uh, 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 this learn marketplace library in motion yeah unreal engine 5 so you can see download settings so yeah to install the engine you must go to this library section so here the first users don't uh, get a interface just like this just an empty uh, an empty one just like this uh, I think it's uh, something just like this uh, you don't have this blue colored one you just have to uh, the, uh, the uh, engine version there now for me the latest engine version uh, is uh, 4.26 to 7 so the new users should get this so it's then if you already have installed an engine uh, you can see the installed engines so here I, I'm throughout this series I'm gonna use this Unreal Engine 4.26 version uh, and I, ho I have uh, previously installed this 4.23 uh, one but I'm not gonna use it uh, or else this 271 I'm gonna use a different uh, but that means this so you can see if you have made it uh, some if you have some pro projects uh, saved in your PC this will show this for you and then here you have your wallet that means the assets that you have buy from the marketplace so here I have free assets paid assets about uh, hundreds of assets are here so and also I have some sample projects so you just you just have to uh, this will some kind of uh, this kind of a thing will appear for the first users you might then you can choose your engine version if you want the you can choose any of these engine versions so I recommend that it would be uh, good if you can choose this 2.26 uh, 4.26 version because we can use this and 2.2 2 uh, 4.27 would be a bit different and the older versions would be a lot different because uh, 2.6 have lots and lots of new plugins so just uh, install this uh, one or you can directly install this 271 so after you choose your engine version you can have this uh, you can uh, set this as your current engine version then it will say not installed but uh, so I'm gonna just set this as my current one so just you have to click install so it will install the engine for you uh, so that's all for today's video see you in the uh, next video